today we will learn about distributive property of multiplication over addition and subtraction of whole numbers suppose your father gives you 3 rupees and your mother gives you 2 rupees every day and you collect them in a piggy bank can you find out how much money you would have saved in 5 days There are two ways to solve this. Method one: calculate the total amount saved in a day, which is three plus two rupees. So in five days, you will be able to save five into three plus two rupees. The solution to this is five into five, which is equal to twenty-five. Method two: the other method is first you will find out the total amount given by your father in five days. and the total amount given by your mother in 5 days now add these two values that is find the value of 5 into 3 plus 5 into 2 the solution is 15 plus 10 which is 25 isn't this equal to the first solution yes so can we say that 5 into 3 plus 2 is equal to 5 into 3 plus 5 into 2 what did you understand from this here the sum of two numbers is split that means multiplication is distributed over addition therefore for any three whole numbers a b and c a into b plus c can be distributed as a into b plus a into c this is called the distributive property of multiplication over addition can multiplication also be distributed over subtraction think for a while let's understand this suppose your father gives you 3 rupees every day and you spend 2 rupees of it every day then what is the amount you would save in 5 days we can solve this also in two ways the first method 5 into 3 minus 2 gives you 5 as the answer and the second method 5 into 3 minus 5 into 2 also gives 15 minus 10 that is 5 is the answer here 5 into 3 minus 2 is equal to 5 into 3 minus 5 into 2 therefore multiplication can also be distributed over subtraction This shows that for any three whole numbers a b and c a into b minus c can be distributed as a into b minus a into c This is called the distributive property of multiplication over subtraction Today we have learned about distributive property of multiplication over addition and subtraction of whole numbers in the next video we will see some examples of this property